I'm really looking forward to embracing some of the great traditions at University of Tennessee. For instance, the Vol Walk, running through the tee, singing Rocky Top all night long after we beat Florida next year. It's going to be a blast. Okay, so get ready. <laughs> The University of Tennessee announced Lane Kiffin as the school's 21st head football coach at a press conference in the Wolf Kaplan Center at Neyland Stadium on Monday afternoon. Kiffin joins Tennessee after years of college and professional experience in coaching, and he is eager to begin working for the Vols. I want the Tennessee family to know this. This is what I'm going to give you. I'm rolling my sleeves up and going to work. I'm not promising you how many wins we're going to have, how many championships. I can't do that. I don't know that. There's too many variables within that. But I can tell you this right now. No one is going to outwork us. No one's going to outwork me as a head coach, and no one's going to outwork our staff that we put together. That's the promise I'm giving you. The wins will come after that, okay? But you're going to see it. You're going to feel it throughout the state. It starts today. Despite only having the job since yesterday afternoon, Kiffin is already hard at work in recruiting, an area where he was considered the best in the nation while at Southern California. As far as recruiting, we've hit the ground running recruiting. Um, took the test a few days uh, before I got hired here so that we could do that. And um, yesterday was the first day we could start calling guys, and we started knocking them out everywhere. Um, This is very important for where we are right now. It's important to have the team meeting last night with our team to touch those guys first so that they knew about this officially before you guys did. But after that, it was right to recruiting. At 33 years old, Kiffin is the youngest active head coach in the football bowl subdivision, only a year younger than General Robert R. Neeland when he took the job in 1926. But growing up in a football household because of his father, NFL defensive coordinator Monty Kiffin has given him a special insight in football. I remember a chalkboard in the back, the old chalk and the green chalkboard, and the white chalk on the ground and just plays everywhere. That's what I remember growing up to. I, I remember that it was neat for me to go on weekends and when other kids were off to other things, it was neat to go up to the office and sit in pregame meetings, you know, before games, you know, back when he, all the way back to when he was coaching in college. So um, it's been an unbelievable advantage for me. While Kiffin is new to Knoxville, he says he already feels right at home. My wife and I have only been here for 36 hours. I'm not going to pretend I know know everything about it by any means. But I do know this. In 36 hours, the passion from the people here at this university and the community from the few people I've run into is unbelievable. To To walk in yesterday and feel the people from the janitor to the president and feel the passion that they have for Tennessee football is special. And it's something that I'm going to understand. I get right now what I need to do, okay? I know that I have a plan for that, and I understand that, okay? And I'm going to bring you guys with me. It's going to be something very special as we do this. Kiffin will be on the road recruiting for most of the coming months as he builds his team for the 2009 season, which will begin on September 5th against Western Kentucky in Knoxville. For UTSports.com, I'm Roger Hoover.